Good day, students. Let us now assess your understanding of our lesson on magnets and magnetic fields. It's time for a quiz. How much did you learn about magnets and magnetic fields? Let us find out. Before we proceed, kindly take note of these reminders. Number one, read and analyze each question carefully. Number two, answer the question on your own. Three, strictly close notes, books, and other references while taking the quiz. Part one, multiple choice. Choose the letter of the best answer. Question number one. Blank is known for observing that the compass needle deflects when placed near a wire carrying a current. Choose the letter of the best answer. Let's check your answer. The right answer is letter B. This important discovery was the first evidence of the connection between electric and magnetic phenomena. He was also the first to prepare pure aluminum. Question number two. Blank is a scientist who discovered that the direction of the needle near a spherical natural magnet form lines that encircle the sphere and pass through two points diametrically opposite each other. Choose the letter of the best answer. Let's check your answer. The right answer is letter C. He called it the poles of the magnet. Succeeding experiments show that every magnet, regardless of each shape, has two poles, called north and south poles, that exert forces on each other magnetic poles similar to the way that electric charges exert force on one another. Question number three. Planck is the device used by William Gilbert to show that magnetic poles exert attractive or repulsive forces on each other and that these forces vary as the inverse square of the distance between interacting poles. Choose the letter of the best answer. Okay, let's check your answer. The right answer is letter B, torsion balance. Question number four, which statement is true if the magnet is broken into two pieces? Letter A, one has north pole while the other has south pole only. Letter B, both magnets will be as magnetic as the original magnet. Letter C, both magnets are stronger than the original magnet. And letter D, both magnets will have a north and a south pole. Okay, let's check your answer. The right answer is letter D. Both magnet will have a north and a south pole. Question number five. The SI unit of a magnetic field is blank. Choose the letter of the best answer. Okay, let's check your answer. The right answer is letter B, Tesla. Question number six. One Tesla is equivalent to A, one newton per kilometer per second, B, one newton per kilometer sec per second, C, one newton per kilometer per kilogram, letter D, one ampere per meter coulomb per second. Let's check the answer. The right answer is letter A, 1 newton per kilometer per second. Question number 7. 1 Tesla is equal to blank Gauss. Okay, let's check your answer. The right answer is letter C, 10 raised to 4. Question.
Question number eight. Blank is a device that can accelerate charges particle to very high speed. It is used in the hospital to produce radioactive substances for diagnosis and treatment. Choose the letter of the best answer. Let's check your answer. The right answer is letter D, cyclotron. Question number nine. The value of a constant called the permeability of a free space is blank. Choose the letter of the best answer. Let's check your answer. The right answer is letter B. The SI unit of magnetic flux is equal to Black. Choose the letter of the best answer. The right answer is letter A. The SI unit of magnetic flux is Weber. It is named after a German physicist and co-inventor of the telegraph, Wilhelm Weber. And the unit has the symbol WB. How did you do? I am sure you did the great. You may write your score in the comment section. Okay, thank you so much. See you on our next quiz. God bless everyone.